I've loved this story since I was eight years old. I um, heard it on the first day it came out in New Zealand, the, the book. So I'm really excited to be involved with a movie based on it. My favorite authors and my favorite director and my favorite screenwriters all got together and made something. So it was it was amazing just to get to be a part of it, you know. Well, it was like the perfect union of two masterful storytellers in my mind. Um, um, Roald Dahl is a, a, an author whose books really gave me a love of reading when I was a child. Giant Country, where the movie, most of the film is set, is an amazing place that Roald Dahl created and Stephen uh, made it that bit more amazing. I went through a lot of different modes with the giants attacking London and, all, and I, maybe even Godzilla was in it at some point, I don't know. But eventually it came back to something much more loyal to the book and I, I, I would have been unhappy if it wasn't loyal to the book. We're hearing that Ralph Dahl would have liked the movie had he lived to see it, so I'm counting on the family that they're telling the truth. I'm sure they are. The opportunity never arose for me to direct for Disney. I always wanted to because it was the only studio I never directed for. But when this came along, it just made perfect sense. To have the castle at the beginning of the movie, come on, what an honor that is. To have Sleeping Beauty's castle right there at the beginning of the film, I've always wanted to see that on one of my movies.